Hi there YouTube. So uh, yesterday as you will have seen from my last video um, I got my new tripod and today um, my new ball head has arrived. Uh, or at least I hope it, that's what it is. Else this video could be very short. I might open it yet. Um, but this is the only thing that I'm expecting from Amazon. So Let's uh, chop it open and see what's inside. Now I ordered the art size ball head to go with it. the um, Arca Swiss plate which I don't really need because I use an L bracket and an iron wrench and a little book. So the ball head is in here. And there it is. And very nice it is too. Oh, it's got another uh, Arca Swiss plate um, right here. So I've got comes with two um, Arca Swiss plates, which is cool. So uh, let's have a look at it then. So that's the main knob for the the ball head. Feels nice and uh, damped. That feels nice. And then you just lock it off. I like the fact that it's a nice chunky uh, thumb screw. You can see that there. Look. Uh, I think that is for the the pan. That also feels nicely damped. That there is to pan the actual plate. And then we have the uh, plate tightening knob. Yeah, quite nice. I'm going to get the tripod out and then put it on so that we can so that you can see what I'm doing. Yeah, you can see that all right, can't you? So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this one off if I can. There we go. So that's the cheapo KNF concept one, which uh, is just a spare I've got laying around. And this is the art size um, ball head made by the same manufacturer as the ball head. Uh, sorry, as the tripod. There we go. That's nice and tight. Now that, I like that because um, one of the things I find frustrating when I'm out in the field is when I slacken off a ball head, and it's not just cheap ones, the, um, the one on the um, three-legged thing does it too. When you slacken it off, it usually just goes woof and it's like really, really loose. So it's kind of all or nothing, whereas this is quite, it's quite not, nicely damped, so you know, it doesn't just flop when you slacken it off. Now, the true test is going to be uh, with a camera on it. Now, I just happen to have handy somewhere. Where did I put it? No, I don't have it handy. Okay, I'm back. I've got the camera. So, first of all, uh, let's level. Now, the, the, the ball head has a little uh, level bubble on it. Now, a lot of people criticize this. I don't know why, I just prefer it that side rather than that side. I like to have my camera in that hand, turn the knob with that hand. I don't like to have to do it the other way around. I mean, the grip on the camera for a star is on the right hand side, so it just makes sense. So, 
oh that slides in beautifully there and there it goes it's gripped on that ain't gonna budge that is solid that's really nice uh, let's just try the pan knob so that turns nicely nicely damped and then lock it off and that's going nowhere ow um, I've also got the um, the leveling bowl on so I could I can slacken that off and move the camera around too if I want to and I've also got the pan knob on the um, on the actual plate which is really smooth so that's really nice so that feels really sturdy now the true test obviously is when you have a, a long lens on so what I've done is I've uh, grabbed my long heavy lens which is my uh, 70 to 200 f 2.8 with the collar on which makes it feel even heavier so what I'm going to do I'm going to take this lens off and I'm going to put this lens on and see just how sturdy it is with a big fat long lens on so there we go and that just doesn't move that is absolutely solid no movement at all so yeah really pleased with that now if I were to do that if I were to hang on that on this one it would probably pull it down well I can move it and it's tightened off the same can be said with the the three-legged thing uh, ball head um, if you're not careful it does uh, droop a little bit um, so yeah cracking little ball head I really like it it's brilliant so tripod ball head the ball head by the way was 49 pounds believe it or not the tripod was as I said in my previous video 299 so for 350 quid um, monster tripod really nice ball head absolutely solid even with a big fat long heavy lens on not going anywhere I'm happy can't complain well done art size this is a brilliant beautiful piece of kit that you've manufactured here great product and I'm really really pleased with it time will tell of course uh, with use um, how um, you know how how it stands up to a bit of abuse but um, the general feel and construction of it feels absolutely amazing so I'm very happy okay um, I'm gonna take this out and use it probably in the morning I could go this evening but it's a bit late now it's nearly four o'clock sunsets about 430 by the time I get anywhere worth going I'll have missed it and there isn't a cloud in the sky so it's probably not going to be not that good so I'll probably go out first thing in the morning and use all this lot see how it feels out in the field thank you for joining me it's a quick one but thanks anyway I'll see you in the next video